I think it's a worthy question. Yes and no. It depends on the genre. Yeah, um, I would say when you read the Bible, yes, take it literally, but don't take it literalistically. Now, what do I mean by that? I mean, if you read the Bible, read the Bible for its full worth, for what it says, what the text actually says. And that also means that you take into consideration the context in which a statement is made. So if there is a parable, then you take into consideration that we are dealing with a parable. If there is prose or poesy, you take that into consideration. If there is symbolic language, you take that into consideration. The Bible is one book, and at the same time, it's a library. It's a collection of 66 books of different genres. There is poetry there, spiritual poetry. Should you take spiritual poetry literally? You know, poetry is about metaphor and symbol and image and picture to inspire you and lead you to discover something in your own spiritual journey. You know, the Bible comes from God, but God is speaking human language and using human, um, human ways of, of speaking poetry and stories and uh, uh, people say take the Bible as it reads and that's really really good counsel but as it reads it may read as poetry or it may read as uh, as a story or, or some other form and you got to be aware of whether it's supposed to be taken literally or not and also context matters it's very important and taking the Bible literally or otherwise, take it in context as a whole Bible. There are timeless truths in the scriptures, such as the truth of God's love and the covenant relationship that God invites every human being to enter into, uh, that we were created for a union with God and harmony with his universe and that there are laws thou shalt not kill thou shalt not steal or commit adultery or covet another person's house or car why because it will make you miserable it will deprive you of the you that God wants to unfold in you to empower you the Bible is about liberation and empowerment of the human being to full dignity, to full growth.